welcome back to Monday Movie Hunting, the best way to start your week. -da 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 -da. I feel like it looks super dark and dull today. I can't find a good place to film the video because it's so rainy and cloudy and just awful. It's really dark. Like the outside world is just dark today, so I'm sorry. But today, Avengers Age of Ultron comes out and I cannot wait. I'm so excited. Of course, I'm going to be picking up the three theory. Can't wait. Been waiting forever. Haven't seen the trailer. Haven't seen the movie. I'm just super duper excited. So basically, this video might be kind of short because I'm just so excited. I find that with ones that I'm excited about, I like rush in, like grab it, and I like the beginnings excited. It's just it's all too much. But anyway, let's go to Strange Bees and go Monday movie hunting. Oh, and of course, the other movie I'm picking up, you guys also all lots of you lots of you guessed correctly, which we'll get to at the end. But it is Age of Adeline because Blake Lively's in it. And I just I'm excited for them both. But Avengers. Yay, Avengers Day! Anyway, let's go. Here we are at the Sainsbury's, and look, there it is, Avengers. I don't know, I've got the picture on the kind of post a bit. Here's the 3D one for £18, which I thought was a great deal because I thought it was going to be 20 or a little bit more. And I will be doing an unboxing of this as well. And here is the, you know, the regular Blu-ray, which is a shame that it doesn't have a slipcover on because, uh, you know, surely we want a slipcover on. Look, you can see the Hulkbuster on the back there, uh, which is really cool. And the Blu-ray does have more special features than the... DVD. I do show the DVD special features as well at some point. And Fast and Furious 7 on Blu-ray is all sold out, which I really, really enjoyed. I did a review of that. There's Age of Adeline. And then there's the double box set. And they did have a Blu-ray one, which I forgot to look at because I didn't actually notice it in the shop. Here is the DVD for Age of Ultron. Um, yeah, I'm sure most of you have seen it. See here on the DVD, it's just a global adventure, whereas the Blu-ray one does have quite a bit more. Uh, Big Bang Theory also came out today, um, Series 8 is that, and that's £17. All these were backwards, which is weird. Um, uh, Modern Family is Season 6, I am excited for this because I love Modern Family. Uh, if you guys like Modern Family, let me know, I really, really enjoy it. Um, so I was excited to see Series 6 came out, and I do still need to pick up Series 5, so I am a little bit behind with it, um, but I do really, really enjoy it. And then also here we had Star Wars Rebels, Complete Series 1. If you guys have seen this, let me know your thoughts on it. Uh, I think, looking at the front here, it's on Disney XD channel, but yeah, if you guys have seen this, let me know. And it had a lot of special features on the Blu-ray too. And there was also a DVD edition there for £15. Uh, here is also more Star Wars, uh, the original trilogy and the prequels, there was £15 each on DVD. I have actually been watching through Star Wars recently, obviously, you know, to prepare for the new one. And anyway, here is more of the Avengers again. Oh, and... Age of Adeline. I didn't really show you too much before. If any of you have seen this, please let me know your thoughts on it because I haven't heard many people talk about it. Um, but I am really excited to see it because, of course, Blake Lively is from Gossip Girl. Um, so that's kind of what drew me to it, but I am really looking forward to it. So, yeah, that's, that's that for that one. Okay, everybody, we are back. Hopefully, you can see me a little better than you could in the beginning of this video. Because, like I said, it's very dark, so I'm sort of right in front of the window, but uh, I don't know. But, yay! Oh my gosh, here it is. Age of Ultron. I can't wait. This is a 3D Blu-ray. I will be reviewing it. I will be watching it in 3D and I just, I'm so excited. I just, I hope it's fantastic. I hope it's so good. I can't wait to watch this. I know I'll watch it multiple times. I love all these Marvel movies and I just can't wait. And also the Hulk Buster is in this one. I will be unboxing this Blu-ray, um, but I did remember, that, well basically what's happened is I'm at home obviously right now and I've left my camera somewhere else and I was like oh no so when I got back obviously I usually film the unboxing first and I was like wait a minute where's my camera so I will go and pick it up later but I think it will be dark so I'm going to try and do it with the lights on and see how it works so I'm going to be hunting it probably up probably will be up before the unboxing of this one um, but it will be up at some point just usually the unboxing goes up first and you know so that's a bit unfortunate um, and also you know the other one I picked up is Age of Adeline and I can't wait to watch this as well uh, again I'll be reviewing it for Friday Reviews and I can't wait to see it hopefully I really enjoy it I am hoping that I'll enjoy this one please let me know if you have seen this I'd definitely be interested in your thoughts and also I didn't know and I was really excited about so I had an itch on my eye I didn't know but Modern Family season 6 came out today which I'm really excited about because I love Modern Family it's so good so what I'm going to do is watch series 1 to four again and then buy series five because I don't have series five yet so watch series one to then five and then I'll buy series six once I've watched all them because I know I'm like I don't get loads of series watched but I kind of do want to watch those again um, and they're only quick so I can watch those like super speedy because I did it last time um yes yeah, so I'm really excited about Modern Family series six let me know if you've seen any of the Modern Families you've seen the new one you've seen series five did you enjoy them I love the first four series Oh, I feel like I'm getting out of breath because I'm so excited about the adventures. I'm like talking faster than usual. I need to whew, slow it down. 
Um, yeah, so let me know if you guys love the Avengers. Thumbs up if you did. Next week, I will be picking up one movie. Comments down below if you want to guess what that one movie is. And speaking of that, let's now jump to the Excel spreadsheet to see who guessed right um, for this week and all that good stuff. And then I'll see you again in a moment. Okay, so now at two we have Laura, Laura Gooding, um, Dinah McDermott, Rory McQuillan Jenkins. Um, let me... I'm never very good at this, you know, it's actually kind of harder than I ever imagined. Okay, because then when we move down, there we go, I'm not good at seeing along. Sean Hargreaves, Amanda L, Daniel Lehman, Thomas Brinson. And then, dun dun dun, so these are still all people at two points now for week seven. Uh, Simon Wayne, Reese Whalen and Wicked Obsessor. Then we have Paige Smith, Movies and Gamer, no, Movies and Game, 007 UK. Um, da, 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 da. Oh gosh, Rich Short at one, and then again at two, Spoon and Mum, and then OJCB Media 21, and Misty Dawn, and Charlie Burnside. So remember, these are all people who guessed correctly last week on both the movies. Quite a few people um, did actually just guess um, Avengers, but then obviously didn't guess both of them, so it was hard to. What's it? So then Patrick Walsh. Also guessed correctly underneath there. Stephanie Fischel, Joel Howarth, Potterhead. And now we're getting down here. WWE RVD posted two comments with a different set of things. So at first I was like, oh, but no. Sullen Embryo. So these were new people from last week. These bunch here. McSpencer3123, Curiosity Rocks as well. And scroll, scroll down. Then we've got the random gamer, and then our one new person for this week added to the list, Alex Pollock. So there we go. So yay! Well done for being a new person this week. So that's really cool. So that's a lot of, lot of people who guessed right this week. I don't actually know how many that is, but there's a lot. So there is the section for week eight. If you want to guess the one movie that I'll be picking up next week, I will put you there in week eight, and we'll see how that goes. So just put a comment down below. So that was the Excel spreadsheet. <laughs> that was a mouthful to get out. Well done if you guessed right last week. I know lots of you did, and it is lots of fun. So, like I say, guess for next week and see if you get it right. If you've never guessed before, go ahead and guess as well, and I can add you on there. And, like you just saw, it is rainy. It is horrible. But the Avengers came out, so all is well. Um, that's pretty much it, guys. I'm so excited to go and watch the Avengers and all that good stuff. Well, I'll edit this video first, and then I'll, well, hmm get my camera do the unboxing then watch the Avengers but apart from that I'm super excited and I can't wait to see it let me know if you guys enjoyed Monday Movie Hunting thumbs up if you did let me know what you think I'll be picking up next week and until then I'll see you guys next time have a fantastic week I'll see you then goodbye